Grace is God being present in our lives and sustaining our lives, but it becomes amazing grace when we become aware of it. And we don't always become aware of it right away. I'm thinking in my own life, uh, I had been ordained 28 years and thought I was doing everything right. And then, sort of like Saul on the road to Damascus, I had my experience uh, with God on a road called Jericho Turnpike in New York. I was involved in a very severe automobile accident. I was in intensive care for 10, uh, 10 days. My family was told that he's in a big ocean. If he's a good swimmer, he'll make it. During my recovery, uh, I began to take stock of my life and begin to understand some of the dynamics that needed to be changed in my life. Going back to Saul, who thought he was doing everything right, I thought I was doing everything right. And so uh, I had to struggle for uh, six months of recuperation. It took me a while to first begin to walk and then to be able to walk around the block and then to be able to walk on a daily basis in uh, the neighborhood. Uh, and I, at, during that time, I realized that uh, I needed to take care of myself. Uh, I had always been the person who would rush after and run into every kind of situation to take care of others. And I realized that I hadn't taken care of myself. And as I look back on it, I also realized that the process of changing into amazing grace, becoming aware of the grace, was a process that took a number of years. And here I am almost 25 years later, and the challenge is uh, that we're very comfortable with uh, saying that, uh, thank God for the blessings, but we don't recognize that God is blessing us in the challenges.